yo, yo, yo. What's good? What's good? What's good? I like that vibe, man. I like that vibe. That's a nice little vibe. What's going on, Smoker family? What's happening? What's happening, man? Welcome, welcome back to yet another live stream. All right, we are live stream ninety-seven. Live stream ninety-seven. We are going to be discovering uh, a brand new house, at least two. Well, not a brand new house, but a brand new house to me. Uh, and my special guest will have a bishop on here with me in just a second. But again, Smoker family, hopefully you all are well, doing great, doing fantastic. Positive energy, positive vibes. Hopefully everyone is truly doing well, okay? I'm excited. Um, seems like we haven't streamed in forever. I uh, wasn't able to stream this past weekend, uh, but we are here uh, tonight on this Thursday. So before we get started, hit that thumbs up. If you're in rocking with us tonight, y'all know it goes a long way by just hitting that thumbs up. Drop your sense of the days. Uh, let me know if y'all can hear me and y'all can see me. And let me know everything is good to go out there. All right, so we're going to head and get to the comments. Um, tonight, we're going to be talking the House of Al... Uh, excuse me. Algabra. This is the Discovery set that we have right here. There's like 13 or 14 in here. We're not going to do all 14, but we're going to do... We're going to probably do close to the whole thing tonight, all right? So um, that's why I'm going to go ahead and jump into the comments. And oh, yeah, sin of the day. My sin of the day... Let's just put it like this. My day didn't turn out to be what I expected at all. Uh, but all in all, everything's good. <laughs> From the House of Banana Republic today, we went with a Vintage Green 78. Vintage Green 78. There we go. Look at that den in that bottle. We ain't playing. Beautiful springtime. Cheapy. Freshy. So, so, so good. I love this stuff. I have another bottle on deck. Um, this is electrifying greens and fig and uh, touch of woods. Um, it's just beautiful. Probably the best $20 I ever spent in fragrance. I'm telling you, probably the best. All right. But that is my scent of the day. Um, I'll tell you guys how this stream came about, um, why we're doing this stream, why this house. And uh, we'll get into all that in just a second. But let's go ahead and tap in. Try to get situated here. Excuse me. All right. Let's go ahead and go to the comments. Uh, Butterfinger. Okay. Eyes of Seven Hills is a must. I've heard. I've heard Eyes of Seven Hills is one of those ones. We're going to find out. And please, if you smell these fragrances, don't tell me about them before I smell them. Because I'm going to scroll past your comment. I'm going to scroll right by it. All right. So this is brand new. Never smelled anything from the house. So give your boy a shot. You know what I'm saying? All right. Kevin Smith, my guy. I don't know. Philly. Good evening, my fragrance family. I'm here early this evening. Greetings, Dedrick and the Bishop. Kevin, straight out of North Philly, for sure. Hidden gems in the house. Talking about that. E Rizza, great. Greetings, smell good family. Hope all is great. Center of the day. Secret Trist. From Fragrance Dubois. Hmm, I'm sure that's interesting. Mr. M. A. Styles in the house. What's up, everyone? Scent of the day is Azaro Chrome Aqua. Good stuff. Terrence in the house. What's up, my guy? He is wearing Thamian Royal Sapphire. Heard a lot of great things about that one. My guy, Mr. Mike Real in the house. Wearing Jasada Ambassador Intense. Scent of the evening. I think you mean Mancero Black Gold for your information. Jasada, Jasada Titanium is in the mail arriving on Monday. I've yet to smell anything from Jasada. I've never smelled anything from Jasada, but let me know how it is, Mike, for sure. All right. Kyle, my guy in the house. Let's go. Remember to show some love and hit that like button, please. And thank you. A thumbs up takes us a long way. Fragrance for turning the house. Wearing one of my personal favorites. Why I sell myself. I love that stuff. I love it for sure. Mr. Judge, what's good, fam? Sit there today, Dior Own Sports 2021. You sir, smelling great. Kaylin in the house wearing Oceania. Whew, you ain't playing with them for sure. Uh, Mr. Clark 30, what's good? Smelling good family. Sit there today, Munden Obsidian. Okay, never heard it. Never heard of that one. Hmm, I'm sure it's great, though. Uh, Michael in the house wearing Lyric from Now Which Is Parfums. What's up, Mike? Carla showing that love. Chef Capone, what's up, smelling good family? Familia. <laughs> Another day, Rosia Parfums, Burlington, 1819. A lot of Rosia love today, I see. 
uh fragrance connoisseurs in the house wearing blue electric a discontinued gym my guy jason virtue in the house wearing gentle fluidity silver going to get me a full bottle of that very very soon gala says vintage green is uh vintage green is cheapy gold i'm telling you i'm telling you vintage green is where it's at y'all see y'all body better get you one i'm telling you jay hernandez in the house when after 9 9 p.m jay what's up kevin what's up my guy hopefully you are doing well glad you're able to join us tonight uh mike says he won a 70 the other day excellent bang for your buck for sure cheapy hall of fame vintage green richie cleats in the house when invictus platinum one of my personal favorites what's up richie uh heat life gun reviews he's wearing must therapy mm, you might be the best smelling in the chat i don't know we'll see we'll see uh dt what's up family center day uh vertus bois a cure if you missed the last stream myself ross and jason discussed that fragrance it is beautiful it is great it is on high so dt you sir are smelling great jay says i'm about to tell you about all on yep and i'm gonna skip by every comment <laughs> JT in the house. Greetings in the day. Ganymede. I'm going to get me a sample of Ganymede. I had somebody hit me in my DM and say, bro, I know you love Boss Imperial. But he said, you'll never want Boss Imperial again if you try Ganymede. I said, okay. So I'm going to get me a sample. I'm going to get me a sample because I do love Boss Imperial for sure. For sure. Um, and tonight, J JT is wearing my number one. Blue to Chanel, our food. <clears throat> King Goliath in the house with something like that. Uh, wearing, smelling good, smelling great. How are you? I'm well, man. Center of the day, Nisha Ne Ani. Day in the house wearing product carbon, carbon and Coach Platinum for this evening. Dame in the house, smell good family. Talk to me nice. Center of the day, Montclair Lacord. Lacorde, I believe that's how that is pronounced. Richie said, just saw the ambassador need to sample that one. Tropical Savage. Yeah, I need to get my nose on it. Carl in the house. What's up, Carl? Hopefully you are doing well. Uh, scent of the day is Awu Blue Notes. You are smelling really, really good. Uh, Airbus is in the house wearing Agave by Precious Liquid. I have that on my list as well. Andrell in the house wearing Fresh Orient. Okay. Everybody's showing love. Charlie in the house. What's going on, Charlie? Good to see you too, my guy. Uh, let's see. Where we at? Where we at? King Goliath. Ganymede is a 10. 10 out of 10, huh, Jason? Okay. <laughs> 10 out of 10. Okay, Jason. Okay. Okay. Um, dang. Ganymede is a masterpiece, but it's different from Boss Imperial. Boss Imperial is more wearable. Okay, we're going to find out. Finish my decan and order 100 ml today. Hmm. Interesting. Kyle in the house wearing Creed Aventus. Um, a classic there. How are you, D? I'm doing well. JT, yes, Ganymede. Now a top five. Ooh, you will love a weight boss at Cure in the mail now. We shall see, my friend. Let us know for sure. Um, got my sister Shoshana in the house. Hey, smell good family. Hey, I hit that thumbs up on the way in. Did you? Did you hit that thumbs up on the way in? I hope that you did. I hope that you did. All right. So we got down to the bottom of the comments. Still waiting on my special guest to uh, get in here, man, so we can have this conversation tonight. Um, I see my wife down here hating. She's saying that she did not hit the, uh, she didn't even tell y'all hey or nothing. She just jumped right in hating. Hold on, where she at? Show didn't. That's crazy. That's crazy for sure. But I'm just going to keep it moving, you understand? Uh, let's see. Charlie in the house. Uh, Yabani Ra. Sorry if I butchered your name, bro. You're wearing gold prestigium. Heard a lot about that. Hey, y'all, hitting it now. It be your own folks, bro. It be your own folks. Unk in the house. Oh, comments loading up. Unk in the house. Family, nephew, blessings to all. Scent of the day. Ooh. Linen Bedford by Banana Republic. Unk, you smelling good, my guy. Two sprays, Carlton. My boy. Uh, Chris in the house. Hope all is well, D. Scent of the day is Do A Days. A fantastic clone of Viredo Sundays. Okay. King Elias talking to Jason. First of all, oh, here we go. Okay. Um, everybody's showing love. All right, man. So we're gonna go ahead and have a quick little chat before we get started. See, uh, the bishop is down here getting himself together. And uh, once he gives me the thumbs up, we will bring 
the bishop on. Uh, let me see. Let me see. Let's get the music turned down. I just like that vibe, man. It's got a nice little vibe. All right, look like the bishop is ready to go. We're gonna bring him in. So, uh, hold on, let me tap, tap in. I get caught back up to the comments. Um, in just a second, so bear with me if I miss your comment for sure. But we will, we will jump in. So, um, the thing with the live streams, y'all, you know, we try to, you know, I try to mix them up, try to mix them up, mix them up, and bring some. Uh, different styles of content. I think the the marquee piece of content on this live stream when I do them is the what's in the bag. Uh, what's in the bag? We have a lot of fun. With what's in the bag? Some great discoveries, some great conversations. Um, you know, just a lot of fun with what's in the bag. We, of course, we will continue what's in the bag pretty much forever. A lot of y'all have shown love to me um, by sending things my way, and um, it's my way of being able to give back to y'all and. And, and sampling these fragrances that you guys want me to get my nose on and having a great time. So uh, we'll keep doing that. But as we move forward, we're going to be discussing brand new houses live. All right. So um, I was able to do City Rhythm um, for the first time live uh, with the Bishop. Um, I was able to smell Ormond Jane um, last year with Jason. I was able to do uh, Savoir Fair um, with uh, Hidden Gems and Bishop um, last year as well. So I want to continue to do that. All right. So going to be purchasing discovery sets um, and, and, and really diving into some newer things. One of my goals when I first got into doing content for YouTube, I always wanted to evolve. I always wanted to elevate. I always wanted to try new things. Uh, excuse me. I just didn't want to talk about the everyday stuff every day, um, the everyday stuff, every live stream, all the popular stuff. That's not what I wanted to do. So I definitely want to mix in uh, bringing some new houses. Some of y'all have probably already heard of these houses and dived into these houses. Um, but tonight, I don't think um, Jason, excuse me, Bishop or myself have ever experienced Algabra. Um, so tonight is going to be a treat for us and you. So those who are looking to elevate their game or get into something new, um, this is the type of 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 live stream uh will help that conversation or help those thoughts of course take everything we say with a grain of salt you got to experience them for yourselves but we'll do our best to give our, our first impressions and kind of go from there so please if you guys have any um uh, input on any of these algabra fragrances i know two specifically eyes of seven hills and the uh one other one that's popular in there shout out justin copeland because that's how i found out about the house through justin and then shout out since sips and sniffs they did a um live stream um a couple of weeks ago on their instagram now they're on youtube and we're going to get into the controversial things that they were talking about on that live stream and we'll let you know how some further content will be developed from that so i just kind of wanted to roll that out there you're going to start seeing a little mixture of what's in the bag uh and new discovery set content here on the live stream especially as we ride into summer so without further ado i want to bring in my guy your guy one of your favorites in all of the community. Definitely one of mine. This is my brother. Great friend of mine. The Bishop. Jared. By God. Miller. What's up? What's going on, people? What's going on with you? How's everybody doing? It smells good, family. Well, well, well. How, how's your day, man? How's everything going? Actually, today today was a little more chill than expected. Um, Speaking of which, go ahead and pay the toss. Shout out to you, Lavelle. <laughs> For sure. Shout out a little Today, bit. I didn't really feel like wearing anything in particular. So I'm sure everyone here in the Smuggle family already knows <clears> about <throat> it, but we keep a shelf for our our workhorses. Some may call it the uh, the dumb reach shelf, right? It's funny enough, Roger's been getting a lot of love today. And yes. I was no different, actually. When I reached okay. for it, just so happened to be Roger Elysium. Okay, a goodie, a real goodie. Like I said, I didn't really feel like wearing anything in particular. I just kind of grabbed for what was easy to go. Something I knew would be think, just easy wearing. And it'd be like that. It'd be like that. I've been laying on that. And as it's you guys stuff. can see, no gloves today. I need to skin real estate. <laughs> yes, we do. 
Yes, we do. All right, so we're going to get started here. Uh, we're going to hang out and going to have some fun tonight. So um, the House of Al... What is it? Let me... Mm. Al Gabra. The House of Al Gabra. We got these discovery sets here. Me and Bishop have been talking about dabbing into this house for quite some time now. Um, we actually talked about it. Um, well, I, I think... I don't know who brought it up. Maybe I brought it up to him. I was watching Justin Copeland in one of his live streams, and he talked about two specific fragrances from the house and i was very intrigued by how he was describing those uh fragrances and i said wow okay let me get those on my radar and then i saw jason and hidden gems uh sips and sniffs um have some conversations so I said, okay the word is maybe starting to kind of get around a little bit i'm intrigued bishop's intrigued got the sample sets coming so i think we both got ours off max aroma um yep, they were having they was having a pretty good sale um, on their discovery sets. So we saved us a couple of dollars Let's look at them. and uh, got them in. All right. We got them in. So I do know uh, the house of Al Gabra is, um, I think they're based out of Germany. Um, I believe that's mm. what I was reading, uh, based out of Germany. Um, don't quote me on that. I was doing some light research getting ready for the stream. Um, but they have these three different collections in this sample set. Um, and we're going to, you know, float around each one of these um, collections and really tap into. So the two for sure that we're going to be tapping mm. into, and we're probably going to start off with the most anticipated because a lot of y'all have been um, saying the name of this fragrance uh, quite a bit. And we the have Eye of Seven Hills, right? The Eye of Seven Hills. That's what we will be doing first. And then we, we will be getting into, where is that Spices one? A Labyrinth of Spices. Yeah. Now, both of these are from the Instable yeah, collection. Instable collection. So, excuse me, we have five collections in this sample. This is a great sample pack. Great sample pack. So, we're going to slide this open here. And as you can see, when Jared was showing you, some of his stuff fell out. So, I'm going to do my best for that not to happen to me. So if y'all can kind of see from afar, this is what we got going on. Look at this sample set right here, guys. This is a discovery set now. Yeah. This is a discovery set. Serious All right. Discovery so set. it is a nice discovery set. We're talking about 14 to 15 fragrances from five different collections. So very excited. Um, got a super chat in here from my brother. Got to holler at my brother real quick before we get going. My man, my, N my NWO, he's NWO too, but FWO. <laughs> FWO Tag team is partner, my man Ross. When you FWO, you FWO for life, my it's man. All life. right, so shout out to shout out to my brother Ross, man, for showing that love. I appreciate him very, very much. He knows that. All right, so let's go ahead, Bishop. Let's get into it. So first up, I think we should do the one that everybody has been pretty much suggesting that we should do, and that yeah, is the I Eyes of Seven Hills, Hills from the. Is this the Instable? Uh, the Instable Insta collection. collection. Yeah, Instable collection. All right, so let's see what we got here. So let me see if I can get it. The fine print is so small on these. Yeah, so let's man. See what we are. The eyes of seven. I'm sure D has already told y'all complete first experience for the both of us. So we're gonna see. Yes, we're gonna see today. So where are we at? Okay, here we go. I'll it's the black what, one. Though. It's the black seven one. Seven Hills does sound pretty good. It does sound pretty it does. good. It does. And Justin made some really kind remarks about it being a little bit better than one of the more popular fragrances out there. So, Jared, if you're ready, All I right. have mine. The Eyes of Seven Hills. Let's get it on skin and let's start the conversation. Go ahead and spray uh, Go ahead and hit mine off in the hand here. Whoa. So, the atomizer on these is pretty strong for a decant. I can tell you that right yeah. now. One yeah, hit. I agree. Whoa. Okay. 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 <laughs> Yeah, okay. yeah, okay. Yeah, okay. Oh, wow. Feeling We're here. up the air. Feeling up the air. We're here. Yeah. In in the air, this smells really good. Now, before we okay. look into the I'm nose. A, I like this one already. Okay. Like I said, I like this one already. Well, you go ahead and kick it off. Kick it off. What you're getting, and I'll, I'll bounce off of what I you got I like this on. already. So, okay. burst the spices. Burst the spices. Absolutely. Hold. I can hold it right here and smell it quite well. Yeah, like I said, the atomizer, good strong atomizer. I don't know if you got. Yeah, for a for, atomizer, for a decant for a decant for sure. For a decant, that's that's impressive. Ooh, Saffron out the jump. Saffron oh, out the jump. 
Yeah, spicy, spicy saffron. I'm sure it'll turn maybe a bit more leathery later, but spicy oh, saffron. This is fire. Oh, this is fire. nutty. Pause. Oh, this is fire. Oh, yeah, pause, please. Woods. We got, got some scoundrels in here tonight. Yeah, yeah. You know, you got you keep them scoundrels. Ooh, so this good. is good, y'all. This is good. So this good. I have seven now, hills. I have seven hills. For me, the same thing. I'm getting a lot of spices here. Spicy I'm getting a, sweet, I'm getting a sweetness here as well. There's a sweetness in here that is, um, I don't know if it's cinnamon. I don't know if it's a combination of cinnamon and vanilla. Cinnamon um, I'm could definitely be like cardamom or something. This is good. So, so I'm gonna say this. I'm gonna say this. So, what this is compared to is uh, initial side effect. Um, you know I'm not what? the biggest fan of. I'm not the biggest fan of side effect. I think it's pretty good, but this is better. I'm gonna if go ahead and get away, that over with. I I see why people say that. I see why people oh, say that. Yeah, for sure, for sure. I see why people say that. Yeah, this is this is better than side effect to me. To me, this is better. The quality is better. The initial notes are more pronounced. You're getting a a, a, a smoothness with there this is, in the opening. Gonna, there is a smoothness. There's a definite smoothness. Yo, this is good. This this is this is good. This wow. All right, D, I got to see these notes. What's in here? Yeah, let's go ahead and tap in. All right. So from the sense of Instable collection, we have oh. Eye of Seven Hills, saffron, nutmeg, cinnamon, whiskey, benzoin. Vanilla, tonka beans, oris, chuli, tobacco, tobacco, amber, amber sandalwood, and there's where that creaminess has come from. Bro. Um, cedarwood, oud, and woody musk. Woody musk. Seven. Yo, they starting us off right, Bishop. Hey, hey, I got I... sips and sniffs. One for one. Hey, that's a one for one right there. It, uh, obviously, we're not going to speak too long. Jeopardy performance, all that other stuff. Yeah, because we don't know. Off rip, we don't know. off rip, we folks. I understand why people compare it to side effect. It's uh, less sweet. Um, oh, it yes. also doesn't have yeah. like that slight cherry nuance to the tobacco. Right. However, uh, this is a very smooth fragrance. Like the saffron right. stands out to me. And the wittiness and the spices and whatnot stands out. Right. But it's actually a smooth blend. Like it came out the gate smooth. Right. It's good. It's good. I love this, man. It's really good. I love it's this. Really good. I'm not going to give it, you know, ranking one out of 10 and all that other stuff. But yeah. One for one. One for one, Jims. Jason. One for one. For one. one. Patrick in the house showing love tonight, saying positive vibes, of course, of course. How many of the people in the, in the chat have tried this? Yeah, I'm checking so out the chat, the chat right now. This, Sean says, love Algabra. I7 Hills is a great frag. Yes, it is. Um, King Elias says, I'm so hyped for the stream. I've been waiting for more people's impressions of the fragrances, especially nice. I of Seven Hills. It's really, really good. Okay. I'm starting to get more of the vanilla starting to peek through now on my skin. Uh, Sean says, it's Cuban just tobacco. a little bit. Cuban to Sean. I'm let me check real quick, Sean. If we have Cuban tobacco, oh, it's in there. D, I will. <sighs> oh, yeah, it's in here. It's in. Here. So, we'll so we will we will smell that one, Sean. Thank you for that because me and Jared are just kind of me and Jared are just kind of on the whim. So, we'll smell Cuban tobacco tonight. So, appreciate that, Sean. This is nice. Um, did you hear what Ross said about the blue fragrance coming out from Joe? I did not hear about it. No. Don't we, spoil it for we me. Gotta, we got We gonna have a talk. About okay, that. we'll talk. <laughs> we'll talk. Ain't we'll no talk. Did you just hit the high notes? <laughs> it's good for sure. <laughs> All right. So Butterfinger said this is side effects. Father that kicked him out because he was too unruly and wouldn't pull up, put his pants. I, I get Funny that. Stuff. I get that. That makes so, sense. That makes sense. So I'm, I'm gonna go back to what I said about the side effects. Side effect is a really good fragrance. It's very, very popular. Do I own a bottle? No. Do I have a decant? Yes. Um, but I am going to say I personally prefer uh, the Eye of Seven Hills over Side Effect. Um, it's you guys smoother. know what it looks like, but for those that may not, Side Effect. Right. The notes are more pronounced. I think you get a little bit better quality here with Algabra. Um, so I could definitely see a full bottle list in my collection in the future um, for sure. Admittedly, yeah. 
Yeah. This is really yeah. nice. This is really nice. It, it really is. Of seven it's, heels. Really nice. It really is. Really nice. All right, Bishop, let's move on, man. Let's move on to Labyrinth of Spices. Labyrinth All right, of now Spices. This, this is now, the second one that we heard a lot about here. Given the name, right, I'm expecting just a, a floodgate of spices. Nothing but spice. But that's well, just the name. Here we go. I found it. Another black uh, atomizer yep, here. Black. Black spices. So don't black chat. Don't worry. We got 86 watching right now. We have 65 thumbs up in the chat. Thumbs if y'all can, can show folks. love, if you're watching, hit that thumbs up for us. We greatly appreciate it. Help pushes the stream out and let everybody know that we're on. And we're talking about a brand new house to me and Jared's noses tonight. And that is Algabra. All right. So um, I'm going to peek in with the chat and highlight comments as we go. But next up, we're going to be doing a uh, labyrinth of spices. And next, it's like Jared different. already has this on his skin. I just hit so my let's see, let's see what we got. I'm getting like a. So two sprays. Huh. It's a different kind of, different kind of spice. Okay, so, so immediately in the air, I don't, nothing is familiar here. No. Nothing it's is different. familiar. It's familiar. Me. Okay, here we go. Oh, that is nice. It's like a soft spice. I don't know what to make of this one. It's like a soft spice. I smell a little bit of a tobacco in here as well. Kind of like the tobacco uh, that you get in um, um, Tobacco Vanille with that Tom Ford. Mm. It's got to be tobacco. It has to be. I get a little powdery do, nuance as well. There's a powdery nuance here as well. Yeah. So I won't be yeah. surprised if Tonka Bean is, is heavy here. Oh, this is nice. This is nice. Some, it's a soft something spice. In this is coming off my skin a little different, a little weird. So not you, weird, so, bad, so, but weird like I'm not used to it. A uniqueness? Yes. It's it's okay. it's weird. Like it's a weird combination or something. Okay. Hmm. Not bad. I'm not saying bad. It's just different. What are you getting? Exposed. I feel like I haven't been exposed to it like this before. Okay. Hmm. What would you say that you're getting? It has like this more it's of a, a unique to it. An almost mm -hmm. leathery feel. Okay. Not like a hard leather, like black leather, but like a it's a little I'm not going to call it a <laughs> uh, a suede leather either. Okay. But a, a slightly stronger leather woods it's some spicy concoction. It's just, I don't know what to put my finger on it. Do you like it? Do you dislike it? Where are you at? Are you just confused by it? Where are you at? I'm not confused. I do okay. like it, but it's okay. different. I like it. So I'm hard. I'm trying to gauge it against other things. I'm not quite putting it together, but I do like it. Okay. It's just different for me. It's just different. The way it's coming off my skin is so weird. I like it. I, I I I like it. It is different here. Let's go over some of the notes um, of Labyrinth mm. Spices. We have Turkish coffee. Wow. Okay. Pineapple. Listen up, Jared. Turkish coffee and pineapple to start this thing off. I, I can tell you right now, I'm thrown already. It's, what? Gabdabum. Tobacco. There's that tobacco. I smelled it Clove. right away. Clove. There, that's what's messing with you? That clove. clove. All right. Clove. clove. Cinnamon. Clove. Nutmeg, oh, cinnamon, anise, nutmeg, I, anise, lavender, tonka bean, cardamom, amber, sandalwood. I'll let you read them off. Go ahead. Read them off. Okay. So from the top, labyrinth of spices, Turkish coffee, pineapple, galbanum, tobacco, clove, cinnamon, nutmeg, anise, lavender, tonka bean, cardamom, like amber, sandalwood, cedarwood, vetiver, oak moss, and of course, a woody musk. I'm thrown by these notes. There ain't no way I'd have been able to guess that concoction going off. The clove in here really threw me, though. Really so I'm going to say this. So I'm going to say this. This is definitely full bottle worthy for me, so we're two for two. Algabra is hitting it off this really, really, really good here. This is different. 
the blend of all the notes, and now that I definitely get some anise, I definitely get that. The tobacco I smell right away um, when it first hit mm -hmm. my skin. You definitely, I get like a soft spice blend here. So the nutmeg and the cinnamon as well. Man, the nutmeg. Is... Yeah, the nutmeg and the cinnamon and everything like that is really, really, really present in the opening. But as this is starting to calm down, the tonka bean is present. I'm surprised. Is there any type of booziness in here? I didn't catch any of that. Uh, coffee, pineapple, so you, scabbard, um, tobacco. No, it's got to be this lavender. This lavender is kind of coming off like a um, God, a, like a boozy it. feel a little bit. Man, I can I can tell you all this. Right, so I like it, but on my skin, the clove is jumping out at me real strong. So, so it's not It'll nothing that you calm would probably, down a little later. Is but it something by that no you means? By no means am I saying this is bad or pass. I'm just, just whoo. Well, well, is this it something is that you feel like you, Bishop? Is it something that feel like you would acquire, or something? This that you is would one have to I can tell would grow on me, and I probably would acquire it. I don't know about like a hundred ml, but if I could get like a fifty ml of this, probably, probably. I, I like it. I, I like it. I it like it's, it. The it's thing different. that's throwing me about it is the clove. How pronounced it is on my skin. Are you a fan of clove? Um, not always. Kind of depends. But this, I guess I have to give it a ranking. This is definitely not bad. Would I consider getting a bottle of this? Probably. I probably would. The clove just takes me a while to get used to. That's what I mean by, eh, look, grow on me a little bit. But so I I'm still, I'm off my skin, I'm still getting like a leathery nuance. Definitely yeah. a lot of woods and this spicy concoction topped off, led by, I should say, by the clove. I get an oriental spice feel here. Um, I'm starting to really get a feel for the whole, uh, the, the Middle Eastern um, experience that Al Gabra uh, brings to the table. You could definitely say it, it's this, more, yeah, it's more present in uh, um, this, this, what is it called? Labyrinth of Spices. Compared yeah. to Eyes of Seven Hills, mm -hmm. so it's 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 good. I like both. I I, I like both. So sometimes I, it is I like I that. Sometimes like you'll... both. I do like the other one a little more so far. Mainly due to the oh, Paul, oh, Paul, that's not true. You either like it or not. That's not true because with fragrances, you could go on a journey, Paul. So you're not gonna love something right away, sir. So either you. are you know, you go on a journey with the fragrance and, and and test it out into the real world, and then you'll see for yourself over time. But in this setting, you're not going to find out if you like it or you're not, you know. So just to kind of clear that up for you, sir. Um, And then we get Butter say, is it okay to say? Of course it's okay to say you don't like oh, something, yeah. of course. No, no I, I generally would consider this. getting a bottle of this, folks. That's not for, yeah, this you is know, not, cloud and nothing else. This is, this is not a platform where we say, you know, this is not a platform where we say we like everything. You know, this is not that type of platform. We are discovering. So if you're not, not you, Butterfinger, but anybody who's watching, we're in a yeah. discovery. We're discovering a new house. We've never true smelled first, anything like this. True first impressions. But when you guys Can't are make going it up, along. I, none of that. You guys are going along to, you know, um, how we're feeling for the very first time. So just kind of know the content that you're, um, that you're watching tonight. Is that we are truly going along? So, um, just to kind of get that uh, out there, Jason says they only make seventy-five ml bottles. Yeah, no problem. That's more than enough for me. Shout out Stephen. He's wearing one of my favorite from Mind Games. He's wearing Gambit tonight. Hidden Gem says it's truly a Middle Eastern for sure. It is. Yeah, uh, yeah. I can, I can definitely give y'all credit for that as well. You, this is very Middle Eastern, very Middle Eastern. This last one, hundred percent. The other one was big. more. I'll say. Mm, Western market friendly. This one is definitely Middle Eastern market for sure. So Travis that might be says, a little different if you haven't had exposure to it, but Travis says two Benjamins for a 50 ml. Uh, yeah, that's cool, bro. Everything is a preference, dog. Everybody ain't trying to spend a certain amount of money. Whatever you want to do, that's what you do. Uh, but for me, uh, these two are definitely on the yeah. uh, on the list. Uh, to acquire because I personally like both of these off the rip. Jason's asking us to try. I gotta give credit. Sips and sniffs. 
Two for two. Yeah, Jason is saying try Ancient Fortress. So that's another we got to try. And what was the one the gentleman asked us to smell? Cuban. Cuban tobacco. So we're going to smell that next. So get that primed up, Jared. We're yeah, going to yeah. go to Cuban. Cuban. Uh, I like tobacco. the sound of that already. Full disclosure. You know, I'm trying to go through the chat here and get caught up. So forgive me, y'all, if I kind of move around it. a little bit. Y'all know how I get it. We got 92 watching strong right now with 82 Remember, thumbs up. Likes, you guys don't mind. Hit the likes, folks. Hit that thumbs up for us, man. We're having a great time tonight discovering the house of Algabra. Um, this so far, so good. Um, definitely get the Middle Eastern feel with these fragrances. Um, where are we at? Butterfinger says labs and spices weren't oh, hitting for me. Okay, it's in four. Nope. Um, supply and demand says, but I do need to try new houses, and yeah, there you know, yeah, yeah, that's, that's, that's what we're trying to do. Uh, here on the chat, my guy Randy's in the house. I love me some side effect, one of my goats. I feel you, side effects is really, really good, Randy. But I gotta give uh, eyes of seven hills a nod, my friend. I gotta give it hey, a nod. Look, what the gentleman said in the chat, can you put is his uh, message still in the chat? What he said about it, it's the it father is. of side Let effect. Me. It that's a perfect description. A more sure. mature, disciplined version of side effect. Shout out Sean. Sean with the $5 super chat. Uh, try the Insta Bull Soul in the set. It will put you in the mind of something from Amouage. Okay. All right. We appreciate all the suggestions for sure. Okay. Um, but now we're going to move on. Uh, Kyla. Yes, Kyla. That is definitely one we're going to try tonight. King of Flowers. We're definitely going to try that tonight for sure. All right, Jared, let's go ahead and get down to business. Um, I yeah, already yeah. seen the uh, Cuban tobacco, all right? This so, one comes in a black and gold. It's the only one like that, right? Yep, it's the only one in it. All right, okay, so let's see. get a couple of sprays and see what's up. All right, this one's going to go on inside, dog. Again, every one of these atomizers has been nice and strong. I'm going to say that. That smells, that smells a little familiar in the air. In the Ooh. air, it smells a little familiar in the air. In the air. Smells good, but smells familiar. Yeah. Who? Okay. Yeah. yeah, it smells familiar. Now, I'm going to be curious to see if you pick up what I'm picking, Jared. Because this DNA I've smelled before. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, I'm, I'm scared of it right now. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Now, Cubano tobacco is really, really good, but it's definitely inspired by one of the more popular fragrances from the house of Dior. I'll give you a hint, Jared. In the opening, at least. In the opening. It is definitely strong, but this is definitely inspired by from one of the more popular fragrances from Dior. This is good. This is very good. This is very good. good. You're talking about now, leather jacket. I got to say, right? Now, whoever suggested this, you must be inside me and D's head. I'm telling you right now. Because we are both fans of that Dior line. We are both <laughs> yeah. huge fans of that DNA, right? Now, you might hear us talk about Dior and Parfum the most. But, nah, this is, this is more like the intense. Well, I was thinking tobacco -ler. I got tobacco. Yeah, tobacco. I, I'm getting a nice that chocolatey, powdery nuance. It's reminding me of your own intense tobacco. Really? To this, I'm getting tobacco vibes from this. I'm getting that peach. No, I'm not gonna spray. I'm not gonna spray it. I need skin with it. Yeah, go ahead and get it. Go get tobacco. <laughs> go get it. No, nah, no. This isn't this is inspired by tobacco. Alert. This is inspired I'm by spray tobacco. that after and the live. Know, I'm gonna spray that after the live. Let's see. And you know what? More little story though, folks. Man, yeah, it's really good. It's really good. It's good, <laughs> man. I tell you what, I was primed to get me a, a full bottle of tobacco. I, I was about to say a, if I didn't. If I didn't already have that, Cuban tobacco might be up. This... So let's see what we got. Let's see what we got in the notes here, Jared. So check this out. You get mandarin orange, vanilla, mm. mojito. mojito. Shit, feel me now. Moji mojito, jasmine, plum wine. Bro, there's a plum wine in here. 
tobacco, tobacco blossom, woody notes, and salt. Now I'm gonna say this, and that's just how I feel. I'm gonna say this, Jared. This is better than tobacco. -er. It's got a plum wine better. in here. Come on, man. This is better okay. than Dior. Okay. Okay. okay, okay, okay. It's better. Hold on. Wait. It's better. It's better. I'm sorry. Okay. It's better to me. I like the This one the is my favorite that we smelled so far. Mine too. Mine too. This one. Who suggested this is, in the chat? I, I don't even remember, man. It was so long ago. Whoever it was, <laughs> shout out to you, man. Right. Seriously. Now, follow me here, Bishop. So Go we ahead. got some nice spices here that are really offsetting from what you get with tobacco. So now you got me. So tobacco doesn't even really offer you any type of spices there. No. Of course, that peach, that honey, that, that tobacco in there. But this is better than Dior tobacco. I'm sorry. The white plum. What is it? The plum wine? Yeah. The plum jasmine. Wine. Lit, the mojito. The vanilla. I love the mandarin orange because you don't get a peachy feel here, yeah. but it's close to it. And that orange I, and that I'm vanilla sure. combo, I'm sure that's what's fueling that uh, tobacco -er type of vibe. Me personally, give me this over Dior tobacco. -er. Yeah. Give me this. Now, I will say this has ascended to number one of what I've smelled. This so is far definitely. Tonight. This is definitely top dog of what we smelled so far, man. Cuban tobacco was the name for anybody who's just popping into the chat. Cuban and tobacco. And it's of the Essence of Origins collection. Essence of Origins. This is fire, man. Mandarin Orange Vanilla Mojito. Jesse. This is fire. Great, great, great this, experience. This breakdown is crazy. Plum it's crazy, wine. right? No wonder Jim's liked it. <laughs> <laughs> Wow, it's really good. It's really good. Lord, it's really good. How many are we okay. gonna smell today? Uh, we're gonna try to get at least ten. We're gonna try to get at least okay, ten. One, two, three. All right, I got some more space. <laughs> <laughs> let's go. Let's get back to the chat, man, and see what the chat man. got going on. Where were we at? Uh, Butterfinger said the bitch's face was the same as mine when I smelled it. And Yo, they, and I'm they stunned by like this it. one. I can't front. So I'm, I'm stunned talking, by this. One. Talking about the last one. Hidden Gem says try City of Jasmine. Okay. Uh, Randy, the fragrance dude, Al Gabra sent me a couple Jasmine. bottles and some I decants. The scents were good. Cuban tobacco was my favorite, and the rest I wouldn't buy for the price per mil. Okay. Uh, Hidden Jim says it's a Turkish company with the Middle Eastern perfumer. Yeah, we definitely get the Middle Eastern vibes. Yeah. Um, Kyle says Cuban tobacco uh, is too much for him. Okay. Um, glad Bishop understood my media, my metaphor. Okay. Yeah. Uh, the sensually perfect. explicit. I have only tried King of Flowers from the house, and it is very good. We'll do that one next. King of Flowers. Let's go ahead and wrap that up next, Bishop. Uh, uh, let's see. <laughs> William says the face Bishop is making is hilarious. That's that's how you know it got him. It got him tripping. Uh, Neil it's, says King of man. Flowers is one of the best of the house. Okay. Paul says you you misunderstood what I was saying, Dedrick. I was referring to your friend when he was smelling it. Much love. No, 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 no. It wasn't no shot at you, bro. I wasn't coming at you no type of way. It was just a clarification of, you know, either you like it or you don't. You know, I, you know, you at, at some point you get to that when you experience fragrances. But I was just saying overall, this is our first time smelling this house. Like there's no way we're we're going to be able to have a complete breakdown and a complete view of these fragrances with smelling for the first time. So you're good, Paul. No problem. I appreciate all your support, buddy. Father, all right. Sorry, uh, him, him. Hidden Jim says I was spot on. Here come the tobacco comments, so I know where I am in the chat. Yeah. Uh, Randy says tobacco. I don't get intense, but I said tobacco right away. Hidden Jim says tobacco to me too. Um, I hit up Instable like Soul and it hit back. <laughs> okay, okay. All right. So Dame in here <laughs> tripping over the uh now I hold a phone that's better than tobacco. All right. Um Let's see. What's up, Mike? What's going on, my guy? Oh, Maurice says, now I got to get them samples. Maurice is fire, Maurice. I told you we're going to put you on something new, man. Don't forget Ancient Fortress. Okay. All right, so let's get it going. All right, so let's go ahead and get 
Did you already spray it on? Doing that? Is it King of Flowers? Yeah, you already sprayed it on? No, no, I got it. Just pulled out of it. Okay, yeah. King of Flowers is what we're going to be doing next. And then Jason is telling us to get our nose on something fortress, ancient fortress. So let me find King of Flowers real quick. King of Flowers. King of Flowers. Here we go. That's the uh, black one at the bottom. Okay. No, we're, no, we're doing King of Flowers. King of Flowers. Oh, yeah. No, I got that set up for the next one. Okay, 10 4. All right. So this is the one for me personally. This is the one that when I was looking over the, the sample pack, this is the one that caught my eye. Okay. This was the one that caught my eye. Now, what I've smelled so far tonight, three for three from the house. Um, yep. I want to say that the Cuban tobacco is number one right now, followed by um Eyes of Seven Hills, and then we also the smell Labyrinth. Starting to come out, y'all. All right, so let's get it. Oh, gems. Going to get the inside of my arm, and here we go with King of Flowers. I got a feeling I'm going to like this, y'all. All right. Let's see. One, so three sprays. Two. Yeah. See so if right. I can get in the air. Okay, I got it in the air. And who, boy. Another strong oh, atomizer. Boy. Oh, boy, that is coming out creamy. That is coming out floral creamy, heavy. white floral. Creamy white florals in the air. Must. That smells fantastic. In the air, fantastic. All right, let's see what we Vanillic. got. Vanillic, heavy vanilla. Oh, yeah. my goodness. Oh, my goodness. Yeah. Oh, my goodness. Oh, wow. Wow, wow, wow. King of Flowers is like that. Come on. Oh, yeah, this is number one. This is number one. <laughs> this is number what? one. What is going yeah, on? Yeah, 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 yeah. Just like that, the Cuban tobacco got jumped. Just like that. Wow, this is good. Now, here we are at the part of the conversation about white florals, fellas. Florals in general. <sighs> Here we are, but this, you, has man. Something, this has something special going on. What is this? Oh, my goodness. Yeah, this full bottle. This is the first full bottle I'll be getting. I, I know we're going to smell some more tonight, but this is the first full bottle that I'll be getting. Okay. Oh, wow. D, read, read in the notes, man. I, I need to. <laughs> okay, here we go. King of Flowers from the Poetic Sense of Here Damascus we Collection. Here we go. King of Flowers. Ooh, grapefruit, bergamot, lavender, iris, vanilla, iris amber, amber, and sandalwood. That is so interesting that there is not one white floral present here. Uh, the, I think it's the combination of the lavender, iris, and vanilla. It's giving yeah, that's me what it is. The white floral. I was getting a white floral vibe immediately, but I don't care. Again, obviously, are grapefruit. the sandalwood vanilla iris is also Makes creamy. creamy. All the creaminess, yeah. Grapefruit, bergamot, lavender, iris, vanilla. Oh, my God. Amber and sandalwood. Oh, yeah, this is the first bottle. One. I'm fanning it off my arm so two. I can make sure. Oh, yeah, that's yeah. Cheers to King of Flowers. That's about there. This is sensational. All my floral fans out there, this is sensational stuff. This is sexy. This is date night banger. This this almost has an art of seduction working in its favor. Let me talk to y'all real quick. So y'all ain't ready. Y'all ain't ready for this kind of talk right here. When it we does. start talking about uh seduction. And we start talking about erotic nature. Yeah, that's what we're talking about with this. This is some, this is sex appeal with this fragrance here. Super unisex. Ladies, y'all can definitely wear this too. I was waiting for this. I was waiting for this part. Ladies. Ladies, ladies. you can definitely tap into this. This is. This is really nice. Yeah, I'm getting a bottle of that. 
I see. Yeah. I'm legitimately thinking about that. at least two bottles. <laughs> oh, wow. So I, stuff there. I like I'm still lot. stunned. Okay, let me. I, I'm still stunned by Cuban Tobacco. It's really good. I'm not even going to front. It's, it's still really good. Fun. That plum wine is still coming out. But what just came out of this decant right here? King it's of sexy, Florals. man. I did not it's expect sexy. that at all. King of Flowers is like that, man. King of Flowers is like that. Yeah, it's my number one. King of Flowers is our number one. Cuban Tobacco is one A and one B. Okay, what's your what's one your, one, one, what's your one? King of Flowers Cuban Tobacco? Cuban Tobacco, King of Flowers. I'm with you. Yep. I'm with you. I'm with you. Yep. One A and one B. This is really, really good, y'all. So so far, the I ain't gonna call it hype because there is no hype with this house. Exactly. Um, it sh That's the it should be. It should be discovery. Um discovery, yes. Um, Discovery. supply and demand test would it work in hot floor? No, so no, no, do I think not it's a wear it too thick for super yeah, high course. heat in the but high I think heat. It's a perfect transition not. fragrance, definitely not in the high heat. This is this is to me, this is spring evenings, fall, and winter. That's what this yeah. is. Yeah, see, they the lavender, all I have, and the, the lavender, Cut the up. lavender is not the feature here. No, the vanilla, the sandalwood, the vanilla creaminess is hugging the entire scent. It that like lavender it, gives it a touch of freshness, like it hovers here. It's not a that's, skin scent, but it's that's close, no, no, close. No, it's very sexy. Come hither, it's very sexy. Come hither, very sexy. Wow. So we smelled what four so far? Yes, four, four. two. Three, four. Yes, we smell and four. So Fortress far. is up next. Fortress. Okay, let me get my four. Let me hit the comments real quick. See what it's. We'll see what the the chat is saying. Um, where did I leave? Oh, let's see. Let's see. Let's see. Let's so see. So, Jason, right? I know you got the plug already. I know you got the information. Uh, I need you to go ahead and drop a link wherever you picked up your bottle. I know you got at least one, right? Go ahead and put that down in the chat for me and the folks down there in there because I'm going to come back and see all that. King of Lies said they put all on skin. One bottle. They're about to have to air the house out smelling strong. Yeah, 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 yeah. We all we all on skin right now. I hope I don't go nose blind here in a second. <laughs> I hope, hey, I, hope hey, I don't. Man, look, so far, I am thoroughly impressed with the house. This so Ancient is Fortress is up next. Fantastic discovery set based off of just what we smell so far. Even if everything else is not for me, I see one, two, three, four different fragrances that are potentially full bottle worthy and at least two will be. Randy asked me, do I get a touch of smoking hot in Cuban tobacco? Yeah, you know, now that you mention it, now that it's drying down, smoking hot from Killian, a little bit, a little bit. Yeah, now that it's drying down, Randy, that. I do. I see why he said that. Yeah, for I sure, Randy, for sure. for sure. For sure, for sure, Randy. It's more on the plum side instead of, you know, the apple, but. Mm. Okay, so here we go. Since Jason want to go there, since so Jason want to go there, we can go there. We told y'all this house is better than each other. Okay. I ain't say Hold that. Hold on now. I ain't say that, Jason. I ain't say that. I'm giving you I'm props, not... brother. Nah, nah. Since they want to go there, Don't so stretch. the controversy, the reason why we have this, the reason why we have this sample set tonight, because Hidden Gems and Jason Virtual on their live stream decided to downgrade the House of Nishane. Don't I do said that. downgrade the House Don't of Nishane in comparison to the House of Al uh, Algabra. Now Algabra is that. putting out some work, but I ain't in no means ready to say that this is better. Um, then Nishane. Now, I don't know what kind of super chat this is right here. I don't know, I don't know what the currency is there. Uh, but whatever COP 40,000 is, um, thank you very much from Andre and Andrea Love crossing borders for this super Shout chat. I don't know, 
I don't know what the currency is there. Maybe somebody in the chat knows what the currency is. Uh, let me highlight this real quick. Um, shout out, shout out from Cali, Colombia. Thanks for the tips on this cologne house. Um, if anybody zeros. knows, if anybody knows what this, I don't know uh, what it is, but that's a lot of zeros. What this shout is, you, let sir. me know. But thank you for the support, no doubt. Thank you for the support. All right, we got okay. So I got everybody coming in quick. It's it's ten dollars USD. Thank you very much. Because I was about to say, hold on now. <laughs> yeah, stop the show. <laughs> we was going we was gonna have to end the stream and get these people on the phone for sitting over forty thousand dollars. <laughs> Well, no, 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 no. Shout out, shout out to Andre and uh, Andrea Love Crossing Borders for the super chat. Thank you guys shout so you, much because I almost, I almost got a little terrified. <laughs> <laughs> he said, "Forty thousand." I said, "Say what?" Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I almost got a little, a little bit terrified there for just a second. <laughs> <laughs> so, uh, supply the man says D thought he was going to be at the Benz dealership after the street. <laughs> man down, man down. <laughs> Yeah, I was kind of getting a little nervous there because that was crazy. Yeah, man. Alice says Nisha Nisha Ney is way better. Hey, like, hey, hey, hey. hey. <laughs> Don't get crazy over these first impressions, y'all. Right? Don't get crazy. So Credit this is, is what's going to happen. Credit is due, but absolutely, absolutely. So this is what's going to happen on a future live stream. Sips and Sniffs will join me and the Bishop Jared Miller. And we're going to hold them in contempt of court um, because we need them to explain to us in their opinions. And they have the right to have their opinions and how they feel. We're going to need them to explain to us why Nishane, why this is way better than Nishane. Now, I am not in the position to say that because I love the house of Nishane. We're talking Popular Fico. We're talking B612. We're talking Ani. We're talking Hashiva. We're talking Wulong Cha, that Cha Cha Slide. We're talking some, we talking some, some real heat over there with the house. But um, um, we're going to have Sips and Sniffs on and we're going to have the conversation of why they think it's better than the house of Nishane. And uh, we've been talking name. about this. I mean, how long we've been talking about this bishop on the phone? Like what, six weeks oh, now? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> you best believe your subpoena is on the way. You best believe. So that is going to be that is going to be a future live stream. So y'all tap in. Mm -hmm. So let's get back to it. We know we kind of got away. Um, I thought somebody went crazy and dropped an unheard amount of money in in live stream history. Um, it was real <laughs> funny though. Um, I see uh, Andre and Andrea having the fun. <laughs> At that right there. All right, man. So we are at the 59 minute mark. Uh, Bishop, we're going to smell two more. All right, let's smell two more. All right. And uh, we're going to get into some more of the conversation in the chat. So what do we got next, Bishop? Uh, I think they said it was Ancient Fortress. It's in another uh, black decant here. Ancient Fortress, Ancient Fort. Okay, I got mine. You got yours? Yep, yep, yep. Okay. All right. Clean. All right. Clean, clean. So we're clean up top on the forearm. All right. And then we can go there. All right, let's Ooh, get those skin. Ancient Fortress. Here we go. Two sprays. Woo! Like, we done picked up the pace with this one. Yeah. <laughs> okay. We done picked up the pace with this one, boy. Opposite side of the spectrum of the others that we smelled. Okay, let's see here. Green. Citrusy. Oh, that's... that's um. Aromatic. What do we got going? Okay, so I definitely get some earthy tones here. You know what's coming like off of this violet. again? Violet, violet leaf, clove. That same clovey is coming off like it did on the other one. Do you get any here. violet leaf? It probably any is in here, but that clove is popping strong again. I know it's clove. <laughs> Okay. It's clove in here. There's a musk in here. Has to be. Has to be some type of musk in here. Hmm. This is interesting. So that first initial was like green, aromatic, citrusy. But that's so already faded now. And now I'm getting clove. Yeah. 
Hmm. Let me see. Okay. We hit the first one that's. So this I'm this right. is, I like this the other one with cool. the more. To me, this one is cool. Yeah, this one is cool. It's it's cool to me. It's not a bad fragrance. It smells good, but it's not something I probably would reach for just right off the first experience here. Yeah. Okay, there's. I'm, I'll read y'all the notes this time here, here right? Yeah, so, yeah, yeah. What we got here? This one is called Ancient Fortress, right? So we've got nutmeg, clove, yeah, second idea. ingredient. We've got yeah. juniper berry. Unexpected, didn't know that. Leather, white tobacco. We've got aquatic sea moss notes, amber, sandalwood, cedarwood, oak moss, and of course. The woody musk again. What is it? It's musk, wood musk. That's what yeah, it is. Yeah, woody musk. The same woody musk that was listed above. Yeah. I don't know if it's the yeah. exact same, yeah. you know, uh, accord, but same listing. Yeah. The clove is strong again. Yeah, this, this one for this me one is, is cool. middle of the road. This is cool. middle of the road. It's cool. Not bad. But it's not leaving the impression that the others did, for sure. Yeah, I don't, I don't. The wood musk on here, it's a negative for me. Yeah, this it's is a negative for me. Yeah, this is this for me. It's a no road. I ain't going down the road. Um, this is the first <laughs> miss. This is the first miss for me. Now, in the opening, it's very intriguing because it's, it's trying to get its, it's trying to get itself together here. But whatever that representation of musk. That's in here. It is overtaking this fragrance on my skin. I'm talking about it has it in the choke hole. Every mm. other note in here is in a choke hole. Yeah, the clove is still popping for me. It's still, still yeah, this is a no for me. Yeah, this is a no. This is a no. It's cool. It, it's if, if someone wanted to ask me what would what would be my initial first impressions rating, I'd give it a five out of a ten. A five out of a ten. It's not bad. It don't smell bad, but this is just not my vibe. This ain't my vibe. I ain't dissing the fragrance. Not not gonna diss no creation, but it ain't my vibe. It ain't my vibe. First middle of the road for me. First middle of the road. Yeah, this is a negative, sir. That is a negative, sir. And what we were talking. What what this was called again? I can't. I can't remember. But this one fortress. is called uh, Ancient Fortress. That's what this. And what line is? What line is this uh, from? Sense of Istanbul collection. Yeah, Ancient Fortress ain't it. So yeah, Woody Musk. Woody Musk. Okay. Mm. Yeah, that's a negative, sir. That's a negative, sir, for me. Um, that's my, that's the first miss for me. Um, with smelling from this house, uh, for sure. Smelling from this house. Okay. Um, let's go back to the comments and we're going to smell City of Jasmine. City, City of Jasmine. Jasmine. Now, City of Jasmine. I do love me some Jasmine. So I hope this one hits. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Let's see where we at. I don't know, though. Is it going to hit like this other one? That we'll one, see. Y'all, the King of Florals is. Okay. Let's see. Let's see. City of Jasmine. Randy says, D, I'm telling you, you're talking about sandalwood and vanilla, and I already knew you liked that mix. Just wait until next week. So what Randy's referring to, me, Randy, and Ross, we're going to be doing a uh, blind decant sniff yep, the decant live sniff. stream uh, next week. Um, so I'm looking forward to it, Randy. I'm looking, I'm looking forward to it for sure. So be sure to check out the fragrance dude. I have his information down in the description of the stream once we're done recording. I also have sips and sniffs YouTube information down in the um description once we're done with the stream y'all go show those guys some love mm -hmm. Shout um, and, 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 and subscribe uh to those guys for sure all right uh all right let's get into one more let's get into one more we're getting ready to wrap this up soon all right i gotta move to the other arm now this one Cut. all right so city city of jasmine city of jasmine now we are right. this is what our sixth one we're smelling uh one two three four yep number six Man, I ain't doing that. Right Top arm. Still very impressed yeah, with I the house, it. folks. Yes. I'm yes. 
All right. So let me see what we got. City of Jasmine. I like the Jasmine. City of Jasmine. Let me get this on the I, top. I like this Jasmine a lot. Here we go. Hold on. I ain't sprayed it yet, Bishop. <laughs> All right. Let's go right here. I like this. I'm a fan of Jasmine. All right. We got three sprays on. And, oh, in the air. That smell real good in the air. Yeah, I like it. It's got a zing to it. I like this. I, I smell I smell a fruitiness to this. Mm -hmm. I smell a fruitiness to like this. this. Ladies, so, another one. But, uh, oh, so I know what this is. Wear? Oh, no. I know oh, what this is. I'm going to wear it, too. Yeah, I like this. So Same this again. is this is it's a drop boise type of I feel. Gonna, I was gonna go there. It's Matter of fact, it's a lot true. like it's a lot like a drop boise. It's playing in that field, hundred percent. So I, yeah, I got the a jasmine strong there. pop of jasmine though, strong pop. Yeah, I get the jasmine. I get some apple in there for sure. There's vanilla. I'll be surprised if it's not a vanilla or a sandalwood. Uh, smell type kind of, of that, yeah, on here. mossiness. It it definitely reminded me of the drop I have to say it's, it's super super in the line of Sadrat Boise for sure. But on that note, though, I really like this. It's I good. Really like this. Wow, I'm impressed. This is good. I'm I'm I'm, is, I'm impressed. Really good. I, I didn't know Sadrop Waze would be a DNA that would be you know featured out here like that. So we just got through smelling Vertus's uh Bois a cure. Yeah. Um, which I you know took over Sadrop Waze, but City of Jasmine by Al Gabra is really good. I like this. It's good. I I I think it's <laughs> will I get a full bottle? No. Uh, because I have Sadra Boise, I have Sadra Boise Intense, and I have. If I didn't have it though, yes. If I didn't have it, yes. So I'm gonna let that dry. I'm gonna let that dry down for a little bit. But in the opening, definitely get. Um, I, like, I like this one, y'all. I like this one. A lot of Sadra Boise. A lot of Sadra Boise. I like this one. The jasmine is definitely present. That's the difference. More of a jasmine approach, obviously, due to the name. That you're getting with D with this DNA, but I get a lot of apple. Get a lot of apple in this one. I'm trying to find it on there. Hold on. Huh. That's good. It's good. I, I like it. I like it. Uh, let me see here. What's this one called again? A city of city of Jasmine. Jasmine? Okay. Yeah. Yeah. So, so folks, city of Jasmine. Leather. Apple, jasmine, rose, vanilla, vanilla, mm. and musk. Yeah. I picked it up. I, I mean, I picked up most of the notes for sure. And when I smelled this one for sure, um, the leather, I mean, the apple right away. I definitely get the vanilla, get the musk. Um, um, I haven't got any leather just yet. I, I can see where the rose is complimenting. It's not a standout rose. But it's providing some freshness to this fragrance for sure. So it's giving mm -hmm. that oral, um, that is the um, floral feel to the fragrance. So it's not a just in your face type of a rose. Yeah, it's 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 assisting with the jasmine for sure. Um, this is a really really nice fragrance. Definitely in the lane of Sadrap Boise. Really mm -hmm. like that opening. What that apple provides. Yep. Get a little leather. The leather is starting to kind of creep in as this thing is really getting himself together. This the is a Jasmine solid that scent. I was smelling earlier, it's calmed down now. Right. If Sitting I close. didn't have, if I didn't have to drop Boise, then I would be looking and get into the city of Jasmine. Um, like for sure, for sure. Uh, it's really, really good. That one is really good. If I'm you are a fan kind of Sidrop Boise, like he is describing, you're going to like this one. You're going to like it. I agree. Uh, I agree. And like I said, for me, uh, I won't be in a position to get a uh, full bottle uh, because I have Sidrop Boise. I have the intense. 
and I also have um, uh, a wire. Yep. So it's pretty, pretty good. It's pretty good. It's pretty good. I'm gonna let this dry down a little bit. And matter of fact, we're gonna go around the block and go around the dry down. Mm. We're gonna get caught up with the chat. Um, my tag team partner is gonna make a appearance as we get ready to close this down uh, tonight. Um, but I'm trying to see where we left off. Let's see. Let's see. Yeah. Where do we leave off? It smells exactly like. Where do we leave? Yeah. Uh, Henry Jim says he bought a full bottle of Ancient Fortress for sure. Um, and like I said, you're gonna, you know, Hidden Gems loves this. I don't. Um, you're gonna have that in fra fragrances, you know. So please don't don't compare what I said versus to what somebody else is saying. Please sample it and experience this stuff on your own. There's no way possible all of us are gonna like the same thing or love the, the same thing. In Ancient Fortress is lasting even longer than it did in this one. Yeah, Ancient Fortress ain't it. It ain't it, bro. It ain't it. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. City of Jasmine is fire for sure. Linen suit barbecue. Hell no. I wouldn't wear this to no barbecue with no linen suit. Barbecue. That's just me. And nah. <laughs> Hell no. Now, I no. get why you're saying that because nah, I can nah. understand doing that with City nah. <laughs> nah, but live your life, gems, and enjoy, my brother. <laughs> enjoy. But I'm just saying, like, for me personally, no, no, no. That's not something that I can rock with for sure. That's a that's one of their, uh, I think, clear cut misses for me. Um, with that, uh, I'm trying to see what's up, Spencer. Spencer in here showing love. Uh, my guy Hez is in the house. What's up, Hez? Hopefully, you're doing well, my friend. Uh, where are we at? Where are we at? Uh, Butterfinger says, Appreciate the honesty, big man. No problem. Uh, there we go. Larry was to drop Waze. Um, I don't really layer, I'm not a layering guy. I have one layer combo that I do, bikini so bottom. But um, I'll try it out, but I don't really layer like that. Uh, now for the city of Jasmine, the one I didn't. Yeah, city of Jasmine is to drop Waze. That's what it is. I'm gonna let it dry down a little bit and see where we at. Um, go with Insta Bull Soul. Okay, Way different. Heavy so Just says you like weed. Um, no, I'm not a weed. I don't. I'm not a weed smoker. Uh, I'm not a weed guy. Mm. I've smoked weed before in my younger days as a young wild man. Um, but hooray for anybody who does, but not me. <laughs> I'm not. I'm not vibed out like that. Um, let's see. Hidden Jim says no rolls. Uh, it's it's not pronounced. Yeah, it's it's adding to the jazz. I can smell sure. the rose more now that the jasmine's out the way. Yeah, the green. It. I want to say green apple. I don't know if it's green apple, but it is apple. Yeah, the apple. apple I, I it, it smell the it rose. smells like green apple. I smell the musk. Uh, Michael says, if you like uh, Cuban people. tobacco and tobacco, or you should try who Hobbinot and Tobacco Nomad. It's better than both to them. Hmm, okay, noted. Steven says you still need to check out uh, eggs. Harmony. Okay. Yeah, yeah, I do, Steven. I do. Um, Hidden Jim says it wears well on him. For sure, for sure. All right, man. So we got my uh my tag team partner from the FWO. We get ready to shut this down. We'll go around the block and smell these dry downs. But we're gonna bring my brother in for a few minutes for sure. I'm gonna answer Julius. Julius, will y'all be testing Labyrinth of Spices? We already did. That oh, was yeah. the second fragrance that we smelled in the live stream. Yep. So if you watch the playback, we smelled that one second for sure. All right. Labyrinth of Spices oh. dry down. Absolutely love it. Absolutely love it. That's good. My guy. Well, hello there. Hey, Ross the boss. What's happening? What's going on? How you doing? I'm doing well. I'm doing well. I had my meal and then I text you. Tag? Question mark? <laughs> yes, sir. Yes, sir. Make Everything sure going well? First. Yeah. Yes, sir. So, Everything uh, going well so, today? So what one was hot garbage? That, that you said this ain't it? <laughs> oh, <laughs> <laughs> well, the one that's not for me is uh, he's talking about Ancient Fortress. Yeah, Ancient Fortress. Ancient that's Fortress, the one that's yeah. not for me. It's what's, not it, for me. what's it kind of like? Because I I caught on right then when you're like, this one ain't it. You know, that's that's when I came back and, and I get this. I get this fun. musk. Yeah, this one, <clears throat> this musk overload on my skin. Like it's just a musky. Does, yeah, it's just I'm getting clove and green, and it's still nah, like, yeah. Ancient. Yeah, I get I get musk and I get some earthy touches. I'm out. I'm out on that. I'm out. 
I'm out. But that, um, that one's still middle of the road for me. I'm surprised at how strong the clove is still coming across. It did the same over here, but now this one is dried down and I don't smell the clove as much anymore. Love that one. Love that yeah. one. City of, see, this, again, I said earlier, this is why you give certain things a chance. Once you get used to doing this discovery path, I love this one now. Love the dry down. Just had to work with the clove a little bit. Clove on this one, on the other hand, the uh, ancient fortress, it's still pumping. It's still pumping strong. And this one is still ugh, shaky for me. Yeah. yeah. And again, for anybody who's watching, don't <laughs> take my word for it. I'm not bashing the fragrance. I'm just telling you it ain't for me. Um, so if you're interested in the notes or anything, get your sample like we did. That's what we're smelling these off of is samples tonight. So get your discovery set and, and see how you feel about it. Um, and like I said, I'll never trash a fragrance. I'll just let you know it ain't for me. And uh, I just want to make that clear. But the house overall, we smell six different fragrances tonight, I believe. Um, yeah, very strong, strong showing very from the house. the house. Very impressed. Um, very impressed as well. I definitely have at least two, maybe three full bottles in my future. Um, from the house of Algabra. Um, and it's um yeah, I really I like the discovery. I like discovery. So well, that's really that's the stuff. beauty of a discovery set. It'll introduce you to something that you probably would never thought you were gonna get a bottle of otherwise. Because you right. probably didn't think, oh, I need to try that. And you stumble across it in the discovery set. And you're like, whoo no, no. I thought it would be this one, but it's this one. Mm -hmm. No, that's facts. That's facts. I've, I've been through that a couple of times. I'm sure like Same. you have too. I know you have too. Ross, what are you wearing today? What are you wearing? I am wearing the new highlight reel, I like to call it, Invictus Parfum. The Invictus, yeah. The highlight reel. The highlight reel. <laughs> because it smells like you're... all of them. Except for mm. the Victory fragrances, the two Victory. Like, literally all the rest of them, Intense, the original, Aqua, Legend, Platinum. Like, there's nuance of all. I smell nuance of each of them in it. Really? Mm-hmm. So I'm calling does it, it, does, it uh, does it wear like a parfum? Yeah, it wears closer. All of them are louder. All the other ones are louder. Okay. Yeah, I want to. So I definitely want to gotten smell. some comments about... um. Like literally, I read a comment earlier that said, I forgot what country he's in. He said reviewers over there are giving it a three, which to specifically say reviewers are giving it three out of 10 in performance. I believe he watched a video and that dude said it's a three out of 10 in performance. Um, but three it just goes back to try it for yourself because it's not loud compared to the other ones. But it did last all day on my hand yesterday. Still on, just rubbing my neck. I smell it on my fingers immediately. I sprayed it on. Six hours ago, it's that performance. It's fine. Everybody's it's different. It's just because um, just you don't smell it pumping off of your neck like crazy, doesn't mean it's not still Could doing be nose thing. blind, you know. Yeah, it's <laughs> I got a little bit of olfactory fatigue going on for sure. It happens with every fragrance, with everyone. There's just levels to it depending on your individual sensitivity, you know. But sure. it's a good fragrance. Now, I wouldn't say go run out and blind buy it for 140 like I did. But if you love Invictus, that's the only person I would say, yeah, go for it. Why not? You're going to do it anyway. But anybody else, just sample first. If you yeah, sample, sample, sample. Your favorites. sample, sample, sample. Shout out Miss Heather in the chat. Hey, FWO, Sin of the Day, Alexandria Fragrances, Africano, Barreto, Inspiration of all the Africa. Okay. I got a message to share with you, actually. Shout out with to me. William Rodriguez. Okay. This is a message for you to read as well. Good morning, Ross. Just want to thank you and the rest of the FWO for all life. the entertainment information. It's a nice way for my mind to get a break from the BS life stress is continued amazing content. But he made sure to say, and the rest of the FWO. So all right. Who are you today? That's Shout out to William Rodriguez. For, for, for life, for life, for life. <laughs> I love that people are running with this. I get it every day. I love it. I, I get it every day. Too. Love it. I get it. Man, we need shirts. I'm gonna just go ahead. And say I was about to say, I want shirt. the shirts. I'm working, bro, I, want I, shirt. I promise you. I was talking I to my guy on. I was talking to him on Tuesday. Um, he's got the fonts and everything. So um, I'm working on. I'm not playing. <laughs> I'm, I'm working down. on at. If I, I need to throw some let investment towards it, let me know. No <laughs> worries. No. I'll put I'll, that I'll, bad boy on. I will definitely give you be giving you a call, Ross, once he says it's ready. So yeah, let me know. I'm just waiting till he gives me the green light. 
we'll and then I figured we could do logistics. Some, and we could do some fun giveaways too with it. I asked them about exactly. that as well, getting some extra shirts exactly made. Exactly what I was thinking. Uh, but stay tuned. Stay tuned mm-hmm. for that info. Stay tuned. All right, Jerry, let's go around the block. Let's get your, we smell six. Let's get your top three. And we're going to go ahead and shut this thing down, man. So what's your top three from the six that we smell tonight? Okay. So. You already know, right? So Cuban tobacco, king of floors. 1A, 1B. Mm -hmm. 1A, 1B. But again, I told you guys, this is why you give certain stuff a chance. If you get to know your skin a little bit, that labyrinth of spices is good. It's number three. Oh That's my number goodness. Three. Yep. My goodness. I love the way okay. that smells now. I absolutely love the way it smells. I just had to work. Yeah, it was cold. very interesting. It was very interesting coming out of the shoot for sure. For sure. Um, for me, number one, King of Flowers. That's number one. I'm getting a full bottle of that immediately. Um, Very impressive, that one. Very impressive. You would be led to believe that you're getting creamy white florals through and through. Absolutely. I'm still convinced it's white floral. Right, but the Mm -hmm. vanilla, the sandalwood mixed in with that iris, um, Mm -hmm. and um, I think, the was it rose in there? Uh, The other floral? Lavender, no, excuse me, it's iris. Bergamot, lavender, iris, vanilla, amber, and sandalwood. You'd be led to believe there's a rose. Yeah, it's really good. You'd be led to believe there's some type of orange blossom or... You guys know, Ross, iris lover. Yeah, for sure. Very, very, very... You might want to put your nose on this one, Ross. King of Flowers is like that. That's my number (laughs) one. Number two, that Cuban tobacco. King of Flowers, me too. Wow, that's a good name. I like that. Number two, Cuban tobacco. Good lord. Dior Tobacco is a very, very good fragrance. So strong in here now. But this is better. This is better. The Cuban tobacco is better than tobacco. It's better. The spices in here. I love that orange vanilla. Huh? The gauntlet was just thrown down. Better than Dior. It's really, really good. It's really, really good, man. And my number three, man, Isles of Seven Hills is like that. Isles of... (laughs) I got... Isles of Seven Hills or Labyrinth of Spices. Isles of Seven Hills smells exactly like side effect now, minus the cherry. I'm going to go Labyrinth of Spices. Because I've never been all in on um, side effect from Initio. I've never been all in. Now this is a better this is a better version of side effect that um, the I Seven Hills has. But I gotta go with Lavender Spices, man. I, yeah, I gotta go with Lavender Spices. Lavender Spices is in my top three. So, so King of Flowers, go. Traveled uh, all the way from one on. that was eh to and Lavender Spices. Those are my top three. So, y'all, if y'all have not heard of this house, the house of Algabra. Algabra. Sample set. They gave you 15 <clears throat> fragrances here. We talked about six of them. We'll have more of a conversation about these uh, in the coming weeks. Um, but this is a fantastic discovery set. Max Aroma was running a really great sale on this discovery set when me and Jared purchased them. Um, mm-hmm. So, um, if you are interested in something new, um, I truly believe this is just the way to go. Um, they give you a large well offering here to, well worth buy. Uh, to sample the house. And um, I highly recommend it. I highly recommend at least trying and seeing <clears> for yourself. <throat> Definitely get a nice Middle Eastern Oriental theme uh, to most of these. But when you get to like, uh, what was, it, was it King of Flowers? King and of then Flowers. The oh, it's so different. So in the city of Jasmine, the city of Jasmine, if I did it, if I didn't have to drop Waze, I'd probably order this tonight. That's how good it is. But the it's vanilla, really it really the is vanilla is a stronger showing in um uh City of Jasmine. Stronger showing the vanilla and the jasmine really are strong. They're great good. on these fragrances, by the way. Yes, they are, man. Yes, they are. So thank you guys for tapping in with us. A lot of y'all seem to have had some great experience with the house. 
Um, and like I said, we're not done here. We're going to carry some conversation uh, at a, a later, sooner than later date. To, yeah, 12 more. You know, yeah, 12 more. To have some more. And I'll probably do some dedicated videos um, to a couple of these. So look out for mm -hmm. some uh, reviews um, on these because um, I'm going to wear these samples. I'm going to wear them and I uh, want to get a good feel for them because I definitely want to add some full bottles. And shout out to Justin Copeland um, for putting this on the radar, on my radar at least. Fresh yeah, he was the first one I heard talk about the house. Um, and then I heard Sips and Sniffs talk about the house. So shout out to uh, Jason and Hidden Gems uh, for sure. And All Justin right? Cope so, on the road to 100K. He is less than 10,000 away. You better believe Get that. him there, man. Well deserved. Get yes. Justin Cope. If you ain't before the well interview. overdue. Long Super overdue. overdue. Been my watching this channel for many, many, many years. Long before we became friends. Justin Justin Carlos. I've said it many times. It's my favorite. This man right here, he knows. If you uh, haven't heard of Justin Copeland, you don't know about him or don't know who he is, I will put his information in the description of this live stream. Y'all go check him out. This is We're talking about maybe, quite possibly, the best quarterly fragrance reviewer in all of YouTube, in my opinion. I'm going to throw one at you. Um, he's created his own lane with his uniqueness for his style, topic, personality. Of course, his voice is super unique. And I can tell you firsthand, I broke bread with this man many times. The coolest MF -er in this space. The quality guy here that creates content. Shout out to that. Quality guy. Absolutely. Yeah. Absolutely. Shout Please out to Justin. Out Class him. act. Through and through. Yeah, I'm gonna put I'm gonna put Justin's information for those who <laughs> might be watching tonight in this audience. You might not have checked him out. Y'all check him out, man. Get him to 100 k He deserves it for sure. He, he sure does. It. Absolutely. Um, let's see. Let's go around the block. Bishop, Bishop. any closing, any closing remarks, man, before man, we get up out of here tonight? I can tell you one, this discovery set was well worth it. Uh, yeah, each one of these was a different experience, obviously, because yeah. it's brand yeah. new. Yeah. But those three in particular stunned me, right? Um, yeah, even the the different experiences with the clove, right? Both, like I was saying, it's not, not really one I've necessarily jived with all the time. But I've gotten to know my skin uh, just a little bit, just a little bit enough in how it functions with it that I knew to give that city, that labyrinth of spices, a chance. I'm glad I did because that's bottle number three, right? Overall, this is definitely a Middle Eastern vibe uh with the exception now obviously we ain't smelled at all king of florals ross I oh yeah honestly say king of florals now based on what i'm hearing that. and people doubling down and tripling down on what you guys are saying it sounds like something you would I'm probably gonna love that one ross i gotta say king of florals, uh, yes d yes. thank you for letting me know about the house and i should probably check it out with you i'm glad i did it's like sure. three more, three more bottles plus potentially could be <laughs> coming along. You know, yeah. So I mean, this, I feel you. Great discovery, great discovery. Shout out to the content creators that put that exploration out there for the rest of us to check out as well. I'm grateful for it. I genuinely am. Yeah, genuinely no am. No and doubt. lastly, of course, if any of you have not hit that like button, take a second. <laughs> go ahead and do that right now. Do that for man. If you also are unaware, check out the Sports Desk Live. <laughs> Both these two gentlemen. Yes. They do it live, man. They do it live. Yes. Go check them yeah. out. It's worth it. Doesn't really matter what you want to follow. Huge wrestling at the moment. But sure. Give it a minute. They'll be back into football. And the then football be season is rolling around. Whatever. Yes, football is the devil. Go follow them. Yes, it is. <laughs> Appreciate that, Bishop. Appreciate that. Ross, my man, any parting remarks, man, before we shut this down? I appreciate uh, you for yeah. taking the time to rock with us for a little bit. Man, I appreciate you letting me on as always, man. I, I costa, to say a little bit, you know, uh, King Elias said, Justin Copeland, your favorite reviewer's favorite reviewer. You know, I've said that tagline many times over the years, but if I'm your favorite reviewer, then he's your he's favorite your, reviewer's favorite reviewer. No, that's true. He's he's you know, he's my I'll favorite that for right sure. now. Um, mm hmm. Justin's so unique in the space, man. I want I want 100K for him so badly. I really do. Yeah. I wanted him to hit it before I did. 
we've had many conversations mm -hmm. like, man, let's let's I hope we can get there at the same time. It didn't work out, but this is his year for sure. This is going. Yes, for sure. And, uh, this stream in particular is a very bad influence. It dawned on me when Dedrick was talking a few minutes ago. <laughs> uh, my sin of the day, I bought while sitting on this live stream. I literally last you week did. while we were on here, I was. You did. On Raban's website, buying Invictus Parfum. So yes, you, yes, you were. Chat swayed me and i blame Dedrick for that because of his channel yeah yeah yeah, uh, yeah. it's Dedrick's fault i've been buying all these fragrances i guess i'll take it <laughs> i'll take the blame for sure aside from that um, guys uh may is going to be a very special month coming up that is uh mr Dedrick hicks's birthday he's also going to smackdown it's going to be in jacksonville yes. i won't be yes. there, unfortunately crucial month oh, for me yeah. but um gonna be a hell of a may gonna be a great finish to april i hope you all have an awesome rest of your evening on into the weekend like jared was saying if you haven't su subscribed to sports desk live i don't know what you're doing with your life i really don't um <laughs> and definitely subscribe to this channel if for some odd reason you're here and you're not subscribed you really should be it's more important than the thumbs up button yes yes i appreciate that thank you very much it's always a blast it's <clears throat> always fun um i really enjoy doing this um it, it, it's fun, man. <laughs> it's just fun. And like I said, the energy is just great here. Um, and I take pride in that. You know, we uh, the one thing when I set out to one thing I set out to do on YouTube when I started creating content is to create a certain atmosphere no matter what. And I'm going to stick to that. And I said in my videos, uh, no negativity whatsoever will be tolerated here because this is a space for everybody to come. Um, and have a good time and laugh and joke and share their opinions and and all of that. You know what I'm saying? That's what this space is about. So I'm Absolutely. glad that we get to do it uh, again. Uh, so grateful for great people that I've met along the way. My brother Ross, my brother Bishop. Um, just really appreciate these gentlemen for being uh, fine mm -hmm. men, class acts. And uh, they get to contribute with me to what we bring on these live streams. So uh, I definitely appreciate it. So um, have fun with this. This is everyone has an opinion and none of us are right. Um, I'm going to say it again. Everyone has an opinion and none of us are right. All right. So enjoy what you enjoy. Love what you love. Dislike what you dislike and keep it pushing. All right. So Absolutely. you guys, I won't be back on Saturday yet again. No, I'm sorry. No salsa Saturday this weekend. There's this very special lady. Her birthday is this Saturday. So I will be spinning a lot bro, of time so there. as you should yeah. what's gonna yes. be the fragrance because i know she loves double attack but what's gonna be the fragrance i gotta ask it's either gonna yeah. be double attack or it's gonna be lamar um she loves both of those well if you're trying and to smell like a snack it might should might need to be double attack huh? it might be it might be but i know three she really loves mm -hmm. and those are two of them. So it is. Well, I knew that one for sure based on you telling me. <laughs> Double attack, yeah. It's Mrs. Hicks's birthday uh, this Saturday, so we will be celebrating Drop her. Drop some flowers in the chat for Miss Hicks. Exactly. Yeah, why not? Why not? Flower Drop emojis. some flowers for Mrs. Hicks. So that's what we'll be doing Saturday, guys. Mm -hmm. So we'll be back next week. Now, we'll be on a live stream with Ross and Brandy on Ross's channel. We'll be doing the um, uh, blind smelling uh, decant surprise. Mm -hmm. The funny uh, thing about it vibe. is... Uh, they came in today for Did they? or yesterday Good. yesterday he got them yesterday so literally the right. day after we were supposed to stream they found they got held up in washington dc for a few days weird two day two day priority shipping my ass yeah um, yeah it never it never works yeah. out <laughs> it's gonna be a good time though on yeah, tuesday seven o'clock eastern my channel yep. the three of us Go we ahead. all did yep. can't swap it's gonna be a good time yep so that's where you guys will see me on the next live uh, on Ross's channel, seven o'clock Eastern time, me, Randy, Ross, going to have a good time over there for sure. All right. So y'all enjoy the rest of your guys this week. Be safe out there. Have fun, laugh, spend time with family, friends, or yourself, whatever mm -hmm. you need to do for you, do it for you. Um, just try to enjoy, um, life to the fullest. Cause I've, I, I say it all the time. We are very privileged to just be breathing right now. Um, life is very, very, very funny. And one day, it's like one, one thing's going good, and then the next day, something crazy is going on. So enjoy. Um, and I mean that from the bottom of my heart. Y'all enjoy your life. Enjoy the rest of your week. Enjoy your weekend. Have fun. 
have a blast and uh we will see you guys very very soon and as always positive energy and positive vibes and come on baby let's keep the splack going splack Speaking of the positive energy positive vibes before you do that uh so the genius barry jackson the short bald guy got muscle building i uh-huh. guess he just doesn't know i'm a moderator so why are you talking I'm like i'm get that bitch out of here hide user from channel <laughs> oh thank you i didn't yeah. even see it <laughs> So, and uh, for a name, for a very uh, American name like Barry Jackson, the lingo leads me to believe he's in a different country with the broken English just here to troll me. Yeah. And I'll need to get a hobby. I, I would hope it would be fragrant. Get a hobby, people. Yeah, we'll holler at you, dog. Yeah. So, sorry as always, to, to point that no, out. No, <laughs> no, I'm, I'm glad. Well, first, I was being a loser friend, and you were the last person to get a wrench. So, I'm glad that it worked out. <laughs> <laughs> Everybody was getting rid of me. I'm like, man, you gotta rent on my channel. What the hell? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm, I'm glad it worked out, man. So <laughs> splack up, <laughs> splack it, it down, splack it up thing all around, man. Enjoy. Remember what you put onto this world. Remember, especially Barry out there. Barry. If you're still watching, Ooh, what you put onto this world out is exactly is exactly what you're going to get back. Don't be surprised if that nasty energy that you put out. Is staring you back in the eyes very, very soon. Don't be surprised. All right. All right, y'all. Enjoy the rest of your night. I'll see y'all next time.